Hey everybody, uh, <laughs> well it was kind of anticlimactic, put that uh, mattress on the fire, stoked it really hot, put a lot of logs on there, sucker was gone before I can get my phone. I came back and it was just a smoldering pile of metal, but you know, you get away with that on top. Can't get away with that anywhere else. And now I'm going to have to cut it all up and make it uh, make it money. Got a little bit of money today from my my sales. Um. Nothing major. Burn a little fire tonight. Gave her to some of the trash. Um, Got to help my neighbor tomorrow. And he's going to bring me a uh, enclosure for my uh, generator. I love the barter. Didn't cost me a penny. So, it's hot cooling off now <laughs> I'm like 30 35 feet away and that sucker made me sweat so it's uh, it's gone we we'll just let it burn all night we've got about 14 mile an hour winds so it's taken everything. It just lit it up, fried it. Wow, that was fast. Well, there's no more garbage left. Got to figure out what to do with the glass. Everything else goes to the burn pit. And uh, maybe I'll make some glasses to drink out of. Maybe some nice lights. Who knows? Who knows? Talked to my neighbor. He's cleaning his area over there. He sold some trees. Made a good dollar on it. So we talked for about 30 minutes. I'm going to meet those guys tomorrow and sell some trees off my property and get some money. <clears throat> I need I need the area anyway, and I need them to put the roads in. So, saves me from renting big equipment when they'll do it themselves. So, it should work out fine. Um, don't have a lot of money. Still fighting. Oh my God, to get some unemployment money. I don't know what's wrong with these people, but it is where it is. I got a house. I'm going to finish up the bedroom area tomorrow. I'll take some video of it. It's looking good. I'm doing, you know, I'm not rebuilding the wheel. I'm using the parts I got. I'm using whatever materials I have. That's it. Prime it and paint it. Put the old frame in there. Put a mattress on it. It might make a little facade. You know, for like water and some books and remote holder. I don't know. We'll see. Because it's Gosh, it's almost, you know, eight foot long. I'm only going to get a queen mattress, so I don't need that much space. It's not like I've got uh, three people sleeping in there. It's just me. So um, that's it for today. Fire's going to go out here in the next hour. Sun's going down. 
It used to get dark about 8 o'clock, but now it's like 9. Full moon. You can walk out here like there's a light on. It's amazing. Being on top. It's, it's really cool. All right. Well, tomorrow's another day. Got a lot planned. Got a lot of work to do. It's going to rain Thursday and Friday. So I got to get as much done as possible. And then we'll uh, see what the cost analysis is on the mattress. Because that's going to be a big thing. There's five or six venues I can go to locally. Um, I prefer not to order something. I don't have an address yet. So I can't get anything shipped here. It's either too much storage in it, 30 minutes away which is an hour trip or uh, get it delivered to my neighbor's house, which UPS doesn't deliver. Eh. I'll be picking up water from him tomorrow. You know, Wednesday is water day. We'll see what happens. Anyway, I uh, hope everybody is healthy and happy. You know, live your dream. No matter what it is. You know, I mean, I may go to work tomorrow for a forklift driver. Don't care. It's money coming in. You gotta, you know, you gotta pick your battles. But win the war. You know, any money is good money, especially when you have any coming in. So have a good night. Be safe. And think, what is it you need to do when everything stops? Be ahead of the game. Don't wait till the last minute. When each ATM don't work, EBT don't work, banks don't work, don't wait to the end. Do it now. Prepare. What do I got to do just in case? And if nothing happens, you're ahead of the game. You're better prepared than everybody else. But... If it goes south, man, it's going to be a lot of problems. Look at all the problems we're having right now. And it's not even over yet. All right, well, on a lighter note, <laughs> burn the fire once in a while. Feels good. <laughs> Get a burn pit in your backyard. Even if it's a couple cardboard boxes. It feels good. Well, I'll talk to you tomorrow. <laughs>